Not being baptized is something that's really gnawed at me for years of not being. And I feel like that this is something that uh, I needed to be done. And uh, I feel, I mean, I know that this is a church for to be baptized in. But a lot of people couldn't accept what I've got. I don't think, I think that they would have thrown their hands up a long time ago. But uh, I think with the conversation that I've had with God that uh, he's pulling me through this. There was one particular night that I didn't think that I was going to make it through the night, to be honest with you. The flower bed that, uh, that you see, that this was built starting off when I was feeling so bad that I felt like that I had to get out here and do a little bit. And I tell everybody that, uh, I mean, I can't help what I've got but I'll make do with what I do have and make the best of it. But Brian, this is my playhouse right here and my play toys that I have. And uh, these are some of the things that I've gotten into since that I've been able to use my hands a little bit. And that's the same thing with walking too, that I've had to learn how to walk all over again as well as to use my hands. But uh, I feel like my place is in church. And I hate that uh, I gave up all of those years, but those all of those years passed, and uh, you missed a lot. Missed an awful lot. I think that uh, baptism is one of the things that uh, brings your life in full circle. Maybe that uh, I know. Getting ready for this, that uh, it feels like that there's a an handle been taken off my shoulder. You know, I really enjoy the church. I can't wait till Sunday for 